Hi friends, I am Sujoy and today I will tell you how to use your calculator in mode 3 stat or statistic mode. This video has two parts. In the first part, I will tell you about the basic of statistics and in the second part, I will tell you how to use your calculator to calculate those values. So let's start with the basics. In statistics, there is basically two kinds of calculation. Number one is measure of center tendency and number two is measure of variation. In measure of center tendency, there comes mean, median and mode. <coughs> so what is mean? Mean is the average of given data. It is given by sum of x values divided by number of elements. In our example, it is 1 plus 2 plus 2 plus 5 plus 6 divided by number of elements 5 is 3.2. Mean is represented by x bar. Median. The median is the central value of an order distribution. If you arrange the values in increasing or decreasing order, then the median is the middle value of the distribution. In case of even number of elements, the median is given by the mean of the middle two elements. Mode. The mode is the element or property which has the highest frequency or the element which occurs the most throughout the distribution. In measures of variation, there comes range, standard deviation and variance. So what is range? Range is the difference between the largest and the smallest value of the distribution. In our example, it is 6, minus 1, 5. Standard deviation. Standard deviation is the measure of average variation of data entries from mean. Standard deviation S is given by root over summation of x minus x bar, that is mean whole square divided by n. Standard deviation is of two types. Number one is populous standard deviation given by divided by n and second is sample standard deviation is given by divided by n minus 1. Number three is variance. Variance is the square of standard deviation. The formula is same, only the root over sign is missing because it is the square of standard deviation. Next is coefficient of variation. Coefficient of variation is the measurement of the relative variability or consistency of data. Coefficient of variation CB is given by standard deviation S divided by mean x bar times 100. If the CB value is lower, then the data is more consistent or closely bounded and if the CB value is higher, the data is more variable or loosely bounded. Next is linear regression. Linear regression is given by y equals to a plus bx but a is the linear uh, regression coefficient term a and b is the regression co coefficient term b r is the correlation coefficient and x bar is the estimated values of x and y bar is the estimated values of y so friends this was the basics of statistics and is the end of the part one and in the part two i will tell you how to use your calculator uh, for calculation so if you like my video please like it and subscribe to my youtube channel that will encourage me to post more videos. Additionally, like, uh, share this video or share the URL of this video among your friends and family because knowledge is meant to be shared. I am signing off. Thanks for watching.